Hello! I'd like to tell you a little about this building. Uh, the owner of it uh, is Sahnud. I suppose uh, those of you who are looking this video, you know who is Sahnud. This is uh, their absorption center. Uh, a lot of uh, repatriants uh, from Israel who are repatriated uh, to Beersheba live here. This is very long, long building. I will show you a little about uh, this place. Uh, you know, uh, a lot of uh, people live here. Ethiopians are from Argentina, from Yemen. Uh, those from Yemen, they are uh, not simple repatriates. Uh, uh, they have their own program. This is uh, because uh, in their country uh, there is a war and uh, so they live uh, here for free for five years and then leave this place. Somebody adore this hostel, somebody hate this place. <laughs> but um, anyway, uh, for a month or two months it's very really comfortable to come here when you don't know the town, when you don't uh, know uh, how to rent uh, the flat uh, abroad. So it's uh, easier to come uh, here firstly and uh, from here looking for another apartment. I will show you the typical uh, flat or apartment, uh, but I think it's more flat than apartment. Uh, in uh, this house uh, where we are living, uh, this is typical flat for family. It's only two rooms and a little uh, living room. Uh, I will show you. Let's go. This is classes. All these doors. Uh, one door is not class. So here is laundry. Let's look. Uh, let's have a look. So what do we have? There are several machines. This is drying machine. This is washing machines. I don't know if they are good now. You see, this is good because this is work. This is also the cost of washing is five shekels. The cost of drying is also five shekels. This is toilet. So this is a, a little territory. This is zone relax <laughs> because it's always shadows this is an administration and uh, we have an elevator it's good because uh, we have chat your bikes are um, you could stay here the elevator is normal but sometimes it could be broken <laughs> But now it's okay, but for you it was two times when it was broken. And here are very long, long corridor. I hate this because uh, usually there are a lot of people here and they are crying, shouting. Yeah, children will really running on their bikes, their scooters and so on. In the evening a lot of uh, People are drinking here, smoking, and all of these are like, I don't know, we can hear it in our apartment. So, come in, here we are. Uh, this is a um, standard room in our hostel, room flat in our hostel. Uh, here is the kitchen. Uh, unfortunately, no place for stroller. Yes, uh, yes we have a washing machine, but it is uh, prohibited to have it here. Uh, this is kitchen, refrigerator. Uh, there are square 
of this lead is somehow about uh, 40 square meters and you know it is uh, plus 33 degrees by Celsius in the street and we have no air conditioning it is very pity because it's very hot in here this is the uh, first room <laughs> here is the big mess because uh, our pretty son lives here. Hi, 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 hi. Say hello. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> yes, it was some kind. Um, here it is a uh, saloon or it calls the uh, living room in English, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, it is very small for eating but everything is very small in here <laughs> okay let's visit our toilet bathroom here is it shower and the toothpaste thank you very much so very simple but uh, it's okay for living Let's show our last room. This is the room where we sleep. Uh, also not very big. Here is it. Um, unfortunately we don't have any balcony so uh, our clothes are standing here. Yes, cream. Yes, it's cream. So let's go. So this is uh, <laughs> everything. What I what I can show you. That's all we have. Uh, not a lot. Uh, very simple. Mm, what else can I say? <laughs> Uh, to live here is awful because um, there are very, very thin walls, uh, so thin that uh, I think uh, I live with my neighbors, I listen everything, uh, what they do, how they laugh, how they drink their beer, everything. <laughs> this is disgusting because I can't uh, relax in my flat. Mm. This is the worst place of living for for me, yes. Uh, a lot of uh, children are going uh, through the door and the door is not good. So I, I can uh, hear everything uh, that uh, is going on uh, behind the door. <laughs> this is also not good. Darling, what are you doing? Can I help you? Oh my god, you're so sweet. Yes, I think you can. Oh, please, please. Oh, yes. Let's do it together. Uh. So we did it. <laughs> Look at him, he's so happy. We lived uh, here more than one year and I think uh, uh, <laughs> it, it was the worst one year in my life. Uh, oh, in uh, several weeks we are going to move uh, to a normal uh, flat uh, and uh, I, I would be really happy that I living uh, that place. Here in Israel it calls Merkaz uh, Klita or the center of absorption, absorption center. Maybe four or five times for year we didn't have uh, water at all. 
not hot water, not cold water, not an, not any water, and uh, nobody uh, uh, told us that <laughs> it would happen uh, before. Uh, so it was a surprise that I can't uh, wash uh, my baby or uh, drink tea uh, and so on. Uh, also, elevator hasn't worked uh, several times. Uh, uh, what else? Uh, <laughs> uh, you know, uh, there is uh, one man uh, who is uh, uh, repairing uh, everything uh, in our flats. Uh, his name is Mayor, uh, and uh, he has uh, keys uh, from uh, uh, every flat. And uh, he can enter the flat uh, without uh, invitation, I can say like this. Uh, so it was with our friends. Uh, my friend was sleeping. It was uh, nine o'clock in the morning. Uh, she's also sitting with the baby at home. And uh, she heard uh, the ring, uh, but uh, she didn't want to wake cup uh, and uh, she didn't and then she heard like somebody uh, uh, turn uh, the key on the door and uh, the door was opened uh, she woke up uh, stands uh, from uh, the bed and she saw how mayor that uh, man and uh, another man uh, went uh, to the flat <laughs> She told them good morning. Uh, also, there was uh, uh, situations uh, uh, when uh, girls are uh, going out from the shower and uh, saw that mayor on their flat. Yeah, <laughs> and they were only oh, with the, the towel uh, on their head. It, it is awful because uh, you don't feel uh, uh, <laughs> not even safety in your flat, but you don't feel uh, uh, like you are, I don't know, that you, you are a, a normal human. Because it's wrong. You should not do it like this. It is uh, the wrong uh, leg. Oh my god. Oh, this is for this leg and this is for that. <laughs> so I can tell you a lot of stories uh, about this uh, hostel. That stories are not very good. That stories are awful. Uh, and uh, I, I'm sure that normal human can live here only not more than one month because uh, more than this time uh, it is uh, 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 I forgot the word I will, I will write here how, how it is called in English but uh, it is not normal to live here more <laughs> uh, we uh, uh, lived uh, here for a long time because, uh, because uh, uh, there is one plus uh, for such a living. We don't know at what time my husband can find uh, the job. And uh, in here in this place, uh, the plus is that uh, you can live here as long as you want if you're in program. Uh, so you don't have a one-year contract as it uh, usual for uh, regularly uh, flats in Israel uh, so we can live here nine months one month uh, and uh, this is this is uh, why it was uh, comfortable for us but uh, I think it was a mistake for such money in uh, our town in Beersheba uh, you can find uh, not uh, so bad uh, flats because all flats in Beersheba uh, have uh, air conditioning so basis has to be in flats in Beersheba because there are there is very high temperature and you can't live without air conditioning 
So we had uh, stationary uh, air conditioning, I forgot how it is called, uh, but uh, this is not like uh, usual ones, uh, uh, they are not so effective uh, and uh, uh, we've already sold it, so this is why I can't uh, show it to you, I can um, just <laughs> tell you how, how was it, uh, but uh, it is not the same as uh, normal air conditioning. Uh, so this is what uh, what we leave. Uh, I would like uh, to say you that uh, this place is not comfortable. Uh, but uh, there is also one more plus, not for us, but for uh, people who has uh, children. Uh, who are elder than uh, three or four years, I, I forgot, because in the territory of this uh, hostel there is a children's club and uh, you can uh, stay your children for free in this club. Unfortunately, uh, our child is only two year old. Uh, when we came, uh, he was only one year old. So we can't use that club. Uh, uh, so for us it's not a, a plus. <laughs> what is it? What is that? Oh, no. Opa. Opa. Kampot. Kampot. I would like to get an acquaintance uh, for uh, Russian uh, kampot. Russian kampot. Uh, this is a non-alcoholic drink. Uh, uh, it is made uh, from fruits uh, with sugar. So this is compot. <laughs> so you just uh, throw it on the pan and then cook for 15 uh, minutes or half an hour. And then it is ready. Also, yeah. five, yes. He told me it is five bad. Um Look, I will see. Also, we cook uh, compote uh, from uh, dried fruits. Uh, usually, it is uh, from dried ones. And babies are uh, really like it. So you just uh, throw it on the pan and then cook for 15 uh, minutes or half an hour, and then it is ready. Also. Five, yes. He told me this five bad. Also, we cook uh, compote uh, from uh, dried fruits. Uh, usually, it is uh, from dried ones. And babies are uh, really like it. Yeah, I feel like I'm asleep. Yeah, really, because uh, I. I can't explain it. Um, it's not good conditions. It's not a good place uh, for normal life. But what can I say? If you're young, uh, if you're lonely, <laughs> it's a good place. Yes. I I tell those uh, who has family, uh, this is not good. But uh, if you're young and lonely, this is good. This is a good place because uh, you can very easily uh, get acquaintance uh, with the whole hostel and uh, you would be happy here. Yes, this is for you. There are diff different um, types of apartments uh, in this hostel. Also, there, are another, there is another type of flat uh, I think uh, more comfortable to bedroom and uh, also there, there is a three bedroom apartment uh, with the stairs what else could I say I can say that uh, this money uh, which we pay uh, for this apartment are not proper uh, for such uh, conditions uh, that we have 
for the same amount of money in a town you could uh, achieve uh, much more I don't know my <laughs> more good uh, conditions so you will decide uh, if it is proper for you or not but what I wa want to recommend you if you're not from Ethiopia <laughs> or you used to live a normal life uh, you shouldn't stay here more than two months I think two months it's enough for living in such a condition normal human shouldn't live uh, so bad uh, yeah it's not maybe I'm mistaken and uh, for you it would be the best place this is my opinion I suppose you will understand it I hope uh, this video was uh, helpful for you please uh, I waiting likes from you uh, you could write comments uh, if you want to ask me something so subscribe us and just, I would like to see you bye bye